We all rely on rules and regulations like speed limits and alcohol restrictions to keep things in order. But there are some laws out there that are hard to believe. Teresa Strasser rounded up some weird state laws that'll make you say, wait, what? No one wants to get stopped by the cops, right? Well, check yourself, because you may be breaking one of these very odd laws. There's some really, really strange ones that I have no idea why they're still a thing. And to learn about some of them, we turn to animator and author Danny Casal, also known as Cool Man Coffee Dan, to his more than 2.5 million Instagram followers. And we're kicking things off in Connecticut, where your pickles better bounce or else. Apparently, in my research, this all started in 1948, where a few pickle packers, you know, people that pack pickles, were arrested for selling rotten pickles, quote, unfit for human consumption. Maybe that meant they were rotten or sour. Connecticut's Food and Drug Commission said, hey, in order for a pickle to be fit for consumption, you have to drop it from about a height of one foot, and if it bounces, it's safe to eat. And if they didn't bounce. They were fined the maximum $500 fine and their pickles were destroyed. Now we cruise over to Oklahoma where there is to be no bear wrestling. This was put into effect uh, due to animal cruelty violations after things got a little out of hand during something called bear wrestling shows. Uh, yeah, I guess that was a thing. One of the first documented bear fights was back in 1939, and they drawed huge crowds and fanfare. It was kind of like Oklahoma City's culture for a little bit. And it finally came to an end after concerned citizens spoke out. Ever since the 90s, uh, anyone who's found, you know, guilty of participating in bear wrestling matches can face jail time and fines. Finally, if you are in Washington, you better not hunt Sasquatch. Washington apparently consider themselves Bigfoot Refuge. A 1984 ordinance states that killing endangered Bigfoot or ape-like creatures in the forest can get you a year in jail or a $1,000 fine. Now we can stay on the straight and narrow by avoiding breaking these wacky laws.